Hello, welcome back to my channel. My name is Daniel Voido. That's a pleasure to have you here today. According to my training plan, today I'm supposed to do the FTP block session. So I thought that rather than doing yet another boring earth mode workout, I'll hit two birds with one stone. Actually, even three. First of all, I want to stick to my training plan. So what I need to do the FTP block is a long climb, so I can keep the steady power output for long enough. I'll do this is the perfect choice then. It gives me an opportunity to complete this autumn tour of Watopia, as the stage 3 is the only one I missed. That's a bird number 2. So what would be the third one? Well, I try to climb out the lift in under 15 minutes. My personal best here is 52 minutes and 25 seconds, but it was only back in early 2022. Am I fit enough to make it today? Well, I hope so. According to Aldo Zwift timing calculator, I should keep 270 watts on average, which is more or less my current FTP. So it's worth it to give it a go then. Before I start, let me tell you about the rules I'm going to follow. Actually, just two rules. Number one, I set up my current weight in the game settings, as that's the most important factor in Zwift. And number two, I set the trainer difficulty to 100%. Any other in-game features are allowed. So I chose the light bike and the wheel set, and also I'm going to use power-ups if it happens to have any. Remember, it's just a game, not a real up duels. All in-game features are available for everybody. I hope that makes sense to you. Anyway, I'm warming up on this early part of stage 3 of Tour of Watopia, and let's keep to the good part. And here we are. Wish me a luck. Just got a power up. The feather light. The proper one for the job. Ok, so far I'm keeping a bit higher power target, but that's ok, because I, I'm controlling my heart rate, and it turns out uh, I'm still in my lower threshold zone, so feels good so far. Also the first few bands are a bit steeper than the rest of the ride, so higher power output was Required, I'd say. Let's go then. Halfway there, 24 minutes. So I'm a minute ahead of of the shadow. Definitely, I'm starting to feel the fatigue though. So probably I slow down a bit and keep this 270 watts as I should have. So this, so to speak, plateau is a good place to take a shell. It looks like if I keep 15k per hour on average, or even 14, I should be fine. Still more than 19 minutes, four and a half kilometer to climb looks good three k to go thirteen minutes left so still a minute ahead of the shadow 
Keep going. Keep climbing. Yes, I'm on the favorite light. Just in time. Lucky me. Just 2k to go. Eight and a half minutes. I think I can make it. Eight hundred meters. The last stretch. Let's go. Just the three to the finish line. Yes. 48 minutes and 48 seconds. Woo. Okay. I think I kept it a bit above 270 watts on average, uh, despite two slower segments as I've been struggling with the microphone. Still, that was a good effort. I hope you've enjoyed this video. Don't forget to drop a like and subscribe to my channel to not miss another episode. Let me know in the comments what's your PR on the Audi Zwift. Thanks for watching and see you next time. While cutting this video, I had yet another Audi Zwift session and this time it went even better. So my current PR is 47 minutes and 19 seconds at 286 watts on average. So what's next? We'll see in a few months. Again, thanks for watching.